Arsenal coming up with a clutch match. We've never mm. gone past quarterfinals for 14 years now. Mm. Uh, mm. We lost the away leg 1-0, and it was a very poor mm. performance. Given mm. how we have been, what do you guys think? Uh, can Arsenal do it at Emirates? Can we overturn and face the Emirates in the quarterfinals? Go ahead, Mia, what do you think? I think they should do it. I mean, there is no reason why Arsenal cannot do it, especially given the recent form and everything. I mean, Porto, what when was the last match? It was three weeks ago. Uh, three weeks the Champions League match against three weeks ago. But again, they've been they've been exceptional since since that match, right? And I think it's just a mentality thing. I mean, the performance wise, they are like the notch above Porto. And if they don't do it, and again, it just has to come back to that European whatever you know thing. Well, with phobia that Arsenal has, you know, they're not used to in the last, I don't know, three, four, five, or ten seasons, whatever it is. So you can use the yeah, view, it's fine. Just... You won't feel bad. <laughs> you know, start okay. start of the season. No, uh, so I... Me and Nihal asked Nirav, "Are you gonna take a Champions League semi final mm-hmm. over a title title win?" And he's like, "Yeah, I'll fucking take mm-hmm. it." So no, I won't. <laughs> you said I fucking take it. I remember that. <laughs> of course you. Of course yeah, you won't. No, I won't. I won't. I won't. Yeah, yeah, yeah I, I won't. won't. Uh. Yeah, that. Yeah, but the thing is, yeah, they should win it. Sorry, go ahead. Yeah. I honestly feel like it's gonna be really tough, and I actually, I want obviously us to win. Go ahead, but I think like if I have to do a prediction, if I have to put a lot of my money, I think Arsenal go out uh, on Wednesday. Porto, like even after the game, they've been in really good form. They beat Benfica like five nil, which is like yeah. ridiculous wow. for like something of like a. Uh, uh you know like top top to uh, portuguese teams yeah. and they just know how to you know sit back you know be patient and they they have like all these players who can make it really dirty and yeah. emirates is a really anxious uh, place dude uh i feel like just the anxiety is going to get to us mm. but yeah i hope not i hope we blow them away but the, this is what i honestly am feeling i'm also yeah. reverse jinxing the whole situation Yeah, agreed. I think Martinelli is going to be a big miss. Yeah, yeah, and I think Benfica drew in the Europa League as well. I mean, they're not like doing very good as as a club as such, but they drew mm. to Rangers or something. So again, mm. it's it's Porto again. If you just compare teams, Arsenal should go through. I want Arsenal to go through really because you guys, I mean, you guys are like one of the four three teams who can beat City in two just... legs. Honestly, it's not just Porto. Uh, like we losing against Porto, but just how Porto played that game. We had mm-hmm. nothing. We had nothing in that game, zero. And that's the only game in the season where I've seen we us have like absolutely nothing. Fulham mm-hmm. probably was a really bad game for us, yeah. but again, there was something there. Here, there was nothing. It was like full stop. Yeah, dude, I I agree with yeah. you. Though. No, but I I want Arsenal. No, I want Arsenal to go to the other game picture. This is bad. So that you can draw against City, Everybody do whatever you need next to it. As I say, honestly that's the only like, reason. I am a full believer in the fact that if you have three every like if you have a game every three days, you're going to perform at the highest uh, level. I think it's going to be like the best, and I think Klopp has also proved that. Every three, Pep has also proved that. Top two teams are City and Liverpool for the five years, and they have all been competing for four competitions. क्या उखार लिया रूट लोगों ने विदाउट जस्ट हैविंग फैमिली आई गिव यू आई गिव यू वन थिंग अगेन सेट राइट सो आई फील लाइक इट मैटर्स एट द वेरी एंड ऑफ द सीजन एंड व्हाई आई से दैट इज बिकॉज़ सिटी ओनली वेंट ऑन टू विन चैंपियंस लीग लास्ट सीजन व्हेन दे हैड ऑलरेडी वन द लीग 3 गेम वीक्स प्रायर टू विनिंग प्रायर टू लाइक चैंपियंस लीग फाइनल स्टेजेस सो आई थिंक इट रियली मैटर्स एट द एंड ऑफ इट लाइक पास्ट 4 5 सीजन सिटी वर literally going tooth and nail mm. up until the very end so was liverpool but they lost either of the two competitions so i think that's the only thing but i see where you're coming from like overarchingly we're talking about like elite yeah. level here so mm. it, it is always like you know elitest of the elite which is yeah. uh, we need to be to beat city i don't think we are there yet also also i think uh, uh, if you yeah you're right as if you go out of the champions league the pressure especially for this arsenal team the pressure of just having the premier league to make it a successful season we can't take it can't that take is too it. much yeah, I, uh, I, i wish we were in the fa cup but uh, i think just having champions league is going to be a little less going out in the semi finals and all is okay it's i fine. i don't mind why we need to okay. get to at least semi finals And I'll be more confident about the league if we get to the semi-finals. Yeah, we need to go which out. Which is going to be a big achievement for Arsenal. Yeah, we need, like to, we have, need to go out. We have to barely a big done it. Basically, we need to go out to a big team. Let's just put it that way. Not get run over by a big team if we are going out. We can't go out to a Porto. Like, 
it will just haunt me for again for another season if we go to porto it won't let's be honest no, it, no, won't. it won't it won't it like, won't. like it's, it's basically no, won't because we've always gone it no, won't it's haunt you like, like, that's what i'm saying it's repeat it is yeah. repeating itself and so and you know you know what are we going to say are we going to say we are bigger fish to fry and just move on Right? Well, that's we, always... we all know. We all know. We fucked up. So <laughs> we fucked up. That fish is also gonna go. Anyway, <laughs> uh, no, but I think if you, if you lose to Porto, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, but if you lose to Porto, I think right now, I mean, like two hours ago, Arsenal were third. Like you didn't have much to lose, to be honest. Like, not third, like in the first, but right now, given everything, you know, the, the number of games played and all that. So I think you have everything to lose. If if you lose to Porto. league is everything that you play for and you're at the top and you cannot even just stay blank for a second i yeah. think that can play into you know in your poland city's hand but you know i don't know i, I just wish arsenal you know gets through this and then draw city or play money or something and then it, the, i i was just looking at the games i think those games the sandwich between for arsenal i think they're bad they're a sheet or something the second leg for us are between arsenal villa brighton quarter final arsenal villa and quarter final Exactly. I mean, I I did everything so that at least I I know when these these things are going on. So, but yeah, I hope you face Leverkusen next, man. They they throw you out of your Europa League. <laughs> That's a nightmare. Yeah, he's the next manager. Anyway, it's fine. <laughs>